Hi everyone and welcome. What you see here is a time lapse that I shot yesterday. Yesterday I had fed one of my bins, the bin that I call my mixed bin of worms. This bin supposedly has Indian blue worms. I believe it's primarily Indian blue worms, but there's supposed to be red wigglers and European night crawlers in here as well. And I saw no signs of trouble when I first opened the bin. I uh, went in there and I fed it, pretty routine feeding. And then I uh, closed it all up and then I proceeded to head upstairs to create the video. And if anyone's interested in just watching that, I'll uh, leave a card for it in the corner of the screen so you can click on it and go watch that video. But when I came downstairs a little while afterwards to see how things were looking, I found a whole bunch of worm activity. Worms crawling the walls, worms crawling out of the bin, and I, um, I didn't know what to make of it. So I just set the time-lapse camera up for a little while just to be able to observe the activity. And then I, um, and then after shooting some of this footage here, where you see the worms climbing, I decided I had to do something about it. So I grabbed some salty water solution and a sponge, and then I, uh, I went around the edge of the bin, uh, applying a salty solution to all the walls of the bin. And that's typically a pretty good repellent to keep worms from trying to crawl onto something, because salt and worms just don't um, mix well. Uh, salt, as soon as a worm senses any anything salty, they'll just pull away from it immediately. So, you know, after I applied the salt, I shot some more time-lapse footage, and, you know, as expected, the worms remained down in the bin. They're still very active, crawling the surface of the container, crawling over the newspaper coverings, um, going all over the place in the bin, but luckily not up the walls anymore, and not out of the bin anymore either. Luckily, I was able to save those worms that I could find that crawled out of the bin and put them back in the bin, but I'm just wondering if anyone's ever, ever seen anything like this. You know, what's what's the cause of this? I didn't do anything out of the ordinary in the feeding, none that I can think of. Um, so I don't know what I did to cause this. So I'm just wondering if anyone might have some input on what I might have done during this feeding to cause this reaction of the worms, and uh, I look forward to hearing people's opinions on what's what's happening here. So that's just a short little video. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Give me a thumbs up if you did, and hopefully we'll see you back here next time. Take care. Bye now.